In this Asteroid Day exclusive, we introduce you to people who are leading the efforts to investigate asteroids in our solar system, including their potential for great destruction of all we find precious on Earth. If there's any issue that deserves to be discussed on an international, indeed global level, it is a threat like asteroids, which come to us from beyond our own planet. You have to be very careful, of course, if you're tinkering with things out there. Because supposing something is about to hit China, and you start messing with it, and you start deflecting it, and it goes wrong, and instead of hitting China, it hits India, you've not done a very good job. You know? So these are things which really have to be approached as a sort of global committee. When it comes to planetary defense and a threat that really emerges and must have a decision made, governments are very challenged to make those decisions. And if the public recognizes the importance of a timely decision when there is a real asteroid threat that emerges, that's a very powerful incentive for the international community to make that decision in a timely way. It's a global issue in which countries and above all governments have to work together and they have to put money aside to study the subject. And that is the people are always reluctant to invest in something which could be so far away. And so one of the things that my task force was anxious to do was to secure a British contribution to what seemed to me a very important global problem. And that means research, it means looking at how things work, it means being able to undertake the necessary examination of what's happening in the sky. We need procedures in place that have been agreed on so that we don't waste time uh, debating what to do when a dangerous asteroid is seen to be approaching the Earth. The way to communicate it is not clear yet. We are, you know, thinking about it, discussing it at the United Nations level. When do we tell to the people? Uh, who tells to the people? and uh, how we deal with that even at political level. So these are the things that we start to uh, uh, study and understand. So I cannot answer firmly how we would deal with it, uh, but we have to deal with it because once something is known, you know, it goes rapidly to the media, and it's better that the people involved tell about it. So it's, it's a difficult question. <laughs>